experience at the minute but can I just grab a minute of your time to talk yeah, about yeah, what we're doing here so great great example of tech in action um, yeah. and obviously I wonder if you could share a bit more about the power of partnership oh no have I interrupted the game no, 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 yeah, go, go, go for it go for it <laughs> oh wow you're going to be on the you're going to be on the board 2093 <laughs> brilliant stuff okay so power of partnership how is the relationship with AWS making things like this happen so how does it make any difference with F1 I mean, I think what, what, what you're seeing here is, is, is pure AWS technology and, and, and it's a technology play which is, you know, trying to introduce a much wider demographic to machine learning, to analytics, you know, that type of stuff. And I think this is it's just really fun when you come to an event like this, you see the massive queues of people trying to trying to get here. There's a competitive element to it, right? Because, yeah, you know, I will have a go in a minute. So all, exactly, because all of us techie people, yeah, We've all got a massive ego, and we all want to see whether uh, whether or not you know we're, we're, we're as good as, as uh, or we can we can better our um, our competitors. And and I think this is just a great showcase for it. You know, if you go through the the, the initial phases of this, it it teaches you a little bit about reinforcement learning. It gets you a little bit into ML. You know, really really cool way of doing it. And then you kind of race against. You know, you do this the, your first few laps where you where you, where you, where you train the model. You know, your own model, and then you race against your own model. It's just a really cool way of doing it. That's really cool. I love it. I love it. What about encouraging people to get into the industry as well? Again, getting curious, seeing tech hands-on. I think it's a great way to kind of open up, you know, access to sports careers, tech careers, and say, look, you can build something like this. Amazing. Yeah, hundred percent. I mean, that, that's that's what this should all be about, right? You know, especially you know the, the, the partnership between Formula One and AWS. You know, two great brands, two brands who are all about you know within their DNA. The, the, there's this can-do attitude. It's about building solutions. You know, it's about being part of the solution, not being part of the problem and that's what technology is about you know technology is all about you know finding solutions to problems where which otherwise are very difficult to solve right and 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 if we can you know by by putting on events like this by showcasing the partnership through something like deep racer arcade if that gets more young people enthused and and and, and into technology and into the industry brilliant I love it. And what about the fan experience? Well, what can you share about the innovation there to help get again empower fans to be part of the experience too? You know, again, Formula One, you know, going around the tours and stuff. What's changed there too? Well, I think you know the, the, the big thing that's changed, and, and 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 it's something which is manifest through the partnership with AWS, is that you know we're using data, we're using technology to showcase the complexities of Formula One, but to explain the complexities of Formula One in a simple way. Formula One, without a doubt, is 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 the most you know the the most technologically advanced sport on the planet. Oh, I'm off again. Hang on. Uh, go for it. Go for it. I think you're gonna get a better time this time. Yeah, yeah. I'll help you. I'll help you. Just have left a bit. Left a bit. <laughs> I think I'm better one-handed, but I'm not sure that uh, if I come back to it, one drivers would be. Uh, it won't be quite so um, so blasé as to do the Barcelona track one-handed. <laughs> i tell you what, I'm going to add in a bonus question. Your casting initiative, tell us about that, because it's amazing. Diversity in tech, getting more kids involved, opening up access to getting experiences, you know, hands-on with driving. Yeah, 100%. I mean, that's, that, that is what, you know, we want to get more kids, you know, involved in motorsport. We want to get more kids involved in, in STEM education. Yep. And the way to do that is to do it through the grassroots, you know. The grassroots, unfortunately, is incredibly expensive. We're trying to make it more affordable. We're trying to break down barriers. When you break down the barriers, you get a more diverse cohort. It's about finding the best talent, not about the kids who've got the biggest budget. It's about getting kids into technology, into STEM education in a, in a contemporary Textualized way that they can understand and they're passionate about, you know, all of that good stuff. And 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 if we can do that, you know, it's like what we talked about earlier. If 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 by putting on an event like this, we turn one, two, three, four, ten kids onto technology and put them into a into a on on, on the path path of a of a career in technology, it's a brilliant thing. If we can do that with with my carton initiative, um, it, you know, equally it's brilliant. I love it, Rob. Thank you so much. I'm going to let you get back to your game. See if you can get even higher on the leaderboard. But honestly, it's lovely to see you again. Thank you so much. And you. Thanks very much. Take care. Cheers. Cheers. Honestly. Oh, ooh, my leg's gone. <laughs>